So, I wanted to show off a little deal that's going on. I guess it's for President's Day. I don't know if it's the sale price every day, but right now, this new to Home Depot's website not that long ago was put up. And I found out it's already on Direct Tools website. It's to replace the R86008 Fuego. Comes with the 2.0 subcompact battery, that new wall wall charger, and a bag. $63.99. So, anyone plan on going to Hover Freight and buy a Bauer or Hercules, please don't buy this. Better quality, you get the LSA. It's just factory blemish, which not always the case. Sometimes these are perfect, that's just a marketing floor. Trust me, I know I have friends that have ordered from Direct Tools. Power for motor, 525 inch pounds of torque. 50% lighter, 20% faster. Features. Here's the features. Torque, drill drive, 50% lighter compared to the R860521. I don't know why they're using that model, but whatever. Thought they would have used the 008, which is close enough to this, but uh, whatever. Drill speed, two speed gearbox, 0 to 500 and 0 to 1800 RPMs. Half an inch single sleeve plastic chuck. 24 position clutch ring allows adjustments to major torque to, ap to application. Driver, drill driver LED light for improved visibility, confirmation, better extended runtime to the base with four with, with 1.5 amps lithium battery. I thought that was a 2.0 battery, it's a 1.5. Hundred percent compatible with all rigid batteries and chargers. Oh, see, it's a two point oh battery. They messed up. Factory blemished specifications. Look, I'm, I think they got this right on here. I think it's Home Depot's website said it was brushless, and I know it's not. It's brushed. Just like the new impact driver for 79 bucks. I mean, it's not bad. I might buy this just to have around for an extra drill. Do small tasks when I need heavy duty. I'll pull out my uh, hammer drill. Anyway, uh, I'm going to show you the version on Home Depot's website. Give me a split second to do that. Here you go to Home Depot. Sites, uh, same drill, 18 volt cordless. See, nine nine dollars, 63 from Directals. And I'll show you where it says it's uh, brushless, which I think is a complete mess up. Unless they fixed it since I saw it last. Looking for it now, so I can tell you, so I can tell my subscribers help you guys out that's the goal of YouTube as youtubers help each other out just so you know it models 8 r86 01k just so you know doesn't say too sweet. I know it said it we go back back there it goes specifications see they screwed up this is calling it an impact wrench but it's not twenty six hundred they screwed up brushless yes yeah, this is a complete home people need to fix this
find it, I'll show you the impact driver that's coming out. It's not even available quite yet. Let's go into this now and show you. All right. I hate you, Home Depot. So when you search for something, put in your location. I'll do it by this. It should pop up. It definitely should pop up. Nah, that's still there. It's replacing this kit right here. It's 18 volt. They're selling it separately than this one. But this is what that's replacing these two. I had this kit with the old orange charger. I burned out both of them because I'm an imbecile. Whatever. It is what it is. And it cost 200 at the time for the kit. And I had a, another one kit from that same era with a radio. A little more money, I don't remember the price. It was 2014. Right, where is that? Don Impact Driver. Well, I have this. $119 I have. That. That's a good one because it's tactile instead of digital. A lot of people have been having problems with the Octane impact driver with the control acting funny. Oh, they have one here with the battery. Same one. That's a 105 amp battery for 178. I don't think that's a great deal. But where is that impact driver? Unless they pulled it from the website, which they might have. There's a 2.0 battery. Seven nine bucks. Let's see where is that? So I can show you people that 2.0 battery with the charger. That's the starter kit. It's unavailable right now, but it will be. One point five nine dollars. Oh, here it is. It's unavailable right now, but it's on the website. And look, it takes me back to Bloomford, Connecticut. What the heck? There we go. And you can see it's unavailable, you cannot purchase it. But it's new to the market. Powerful motor would enhance economics, 1850 inch pounds of torque. 34, 33% faster driving speed, free parts and service, model R86, remember that, 002B, should be available soon, along with that Mitosaur, that they bring it back to market, the RPM is 2800, the IPM is 3600, not bad specs, I'll tell you that much for a brush tool. $79, and that's the everyday price when it comes out. There's a brush impact, as you can see. It make it look like it's and uh, brush, not brushed, but it's brushed. And this one, you gotta buy that stupid bit hole that doesn't have the bit hole no more, it just has a lanyard. And they sell plenty of those bit holders online that will fit that, so don't worry, don't worry. And that's what it looks like. Alright, I figured I'd show you guys that. Get that going.
Let's see this one. I know that one battery I saw, I found out right now it's in Canada. And it's a replacement for the Octane. It's on my Instagram page, but I don't have it here, so. Because it's not even on this website. It's on Home Depot's website. But in Canada only. It was a 4.0 battery, a new one. Oh, here it is. This is for you, uh... This is for everyone here, and this is new, and it's coming out. You get two 4.0s, the subcompacts, with that wall war charger, and a bag for 99 bucks. Oops. Wrong one. Let's see, hold on. Okay, I mean, no rubber overmold. You could probably put overmold on these. Like a rubber then over would violate the LSA. Less new batteries that are coming not available yet, as you can see. But there'll be 99 bucks on the market. And there's supposed to be a 6.0 battery of this. That's an Octane battery minus the Bluetooth. Here's the name, so it's not Octane. But it has the same benefits. It's like an HP battery. High demand. And I think it's part of the lawsuit with Milwaukee and TTI and all that nonsense over battery. Infringement. That's it for my video. Um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.